Uh, many of you know me, I would think. I'm Counselor Nando Unique. I was born in this ward. I went to this school, and I'm proud of my cousin who's just had it rebuilt. I also went to St. Tim's, St. Catharines, I went to St. Paul's, I went to school with many of you, or your children. Before I went on to get my journalism degree, my political science degree, my economics degree, all of my security course licenses, je parle aussi en français, I studied the language for 14 years, I'm married to a French Canadian, I also speak Italian. As part of what I've done before public service, and during public service, I've sat on the hospital board, my council colleagues twice chose me to be police commissioner, and I might clarify this point right now, they also gave me the privilege of sitting on the hydro board, which, uh, to Beju, is a wholly owned subsidiary of the city of Mississauga. It's part of my job, and it's a privilege to have it. I want to talk about our successes. I think you know many of them all. You read the literature, the stuff that I put out. But Huron Park is such a jewel, and you all know it. What a magnificent facility. $14.2 million, and we didn't do it with levies. We did it with your money. The Cooksville Library. Promised it, it's there. Per square foot, busiest library in the city. We're talking about expanding it, because it deserves it. Queensway Walkway, $2.2 million, funded. Going to be built next year. We're going to come to public meetings so that we can get your input on how it works. You'll be able to ride a bike or walk from Sherway Gardens all the way to Huron Park. Won't that be lovely? Transit, I love transit. I love the transit issue, because I don't think my candidates are enlightened. The fact of the matter is, transit in Mississauga, in Ward 7, I have the finest transit system in the city. I was talking to Bill, Cun uh, Bill Cunningham just the other day. When I was elected in 1988, service along Highway 5 and 10 was 20 minutes at peak. Now it is five to seven and a half minutes at peak. When I was elected, you had one bus in from the go in the morning, one coming back. Now you have virtually full-time service. We've done very well on transit in Ward 7. The Gypsy Moth, our friends from the Gordon Woods, you know, I stood up first and foremost and I said we need the organic spraying or it will devastate the Gordon Woods. And it's been done and it seems to have gone very well. We still have to be vigilant with regards to it. Far more communications, newsletters, you all know about them. Far more to mention. I have public meetings at the drop of the hat just in the last few months. How many issues have we discussed in Cooksville Mungeon Park? Let's talk about some new ideas. One of them that I'm very proud of, and it was in my annual newsletter, to try and redevelop Thomas L. Kennedy. The mayor, the school board trustee, and I, we've struck a committee. It is a dream. It is a very hard thing to do. But to be a catalyst in Cooksville, if we could redevelop T.L. Kennedy, that's on almost 18 acres of land, make it a more urban structure, build it up instead of out, and next door build the finest community center in the city that will serve as a catalyst for the redevelopment of Cooksville. I want to give you another dream. I have a dream to close some of the roads in the downtown core. I've been successful along with my council colleagues. We've now closed a lane of traffic on Burnham Thorpe Road. And I would like to see us do what Rome and Philadelphia do and other great cities, that on the weekends in the summer after business hours, we close Burnham Thorpe Road in front of City Hall, and it will be our great meeting place. And we will do it once Confederation now has finally gone through to Rathburn, and once Webb goes to Korea, which may happen imminently. So now you have a ring road system to get around. Just another great idea of idea. The thing I want to do, because I, I think I've spoken to the issues that we've been successful at, I really think the candidacy of the others, I think this campaign is really coming down to experience and commitment and dedication. Thank you so much. I look forward to your questions.